the, the starting point, point really to start fighting. So we really wanted to design the silhouette and the, the, the stances. Uh, yeah, in a good way to I, I find it, it really, really sells her agility as well. Yeah, right? like just, the you're just right there, and, and yeah. uh, you know already. Yeah. Yeah, so that's really cool. All right, so we're gonna start with uh, what are what are Chin's openers, right? So she has normally lights, normal. Uh, as you can notice, her lights have superior block, uh, so that you can it helps you really like counter people that are attacking. Nice, yeah. And she has heavies as well, right? So they all always look super good. Here uh, we have front dodge heavy. Yeah, uh, if you want to put your oh, yeah. life there, yeah. I was just gonna be like, I'm about to die. No. Just so that, the, yeah, okay. <laughs> now we're back. Um, we have side dodge heavies as well, right? Okay. So, again, really good stuff there. Uh, we also have a little something that's kind of new that we haven't really done before. Uh, we have a neutral bash that's faintable, right? So, we have a rush like this. It's kind of oh. slow, but. There's the bonk. You can faint oh. it. We found the bonk. Yeah, there's people. a bonk here, right? So, you can faint it, so it's really good and mixing up opponents from super close range, having a lot of that stuff there that's super, super interesting. So that works really, really well. It's a good 50 50. Uh, there's other little specific things we'll get into okay. with that specific bash. Um, so, she one of the things that's also really now. interesting is that her light finishers also have superior block, right? You yeah. can kind of see it on the indicator there. Uh, so, again, the idea is when you're in a group fight, when you're outnumbered, in a 1v1 situation, it's not the best tool, mm. but in a group fight, it's super interesting, right? Because there's somebody trying to peel you off and do something. Block them, hit your current target, super good, really, really interesting stuff. Nice. But then, when you look at her heavies, so her right stance heavy is unblockable. Yeah. Her top stance heavy is undodgeable. undodgeable. Oh, and her nice. left stance heavy displaces. So if we go. Oh, she has here, all three. You can see that it. Wait, we're going to do it a little bit yeah, more. Yeah. Yeah. It's in a wall splat here, right? Ah. And I can get top heavy off, I can get like different things off. So. Again, we really want her to have like that choice here where she literally has that built-in mix-up of I'm going to do unblockable, I'm doing undodgeable. She also has a bash in her chain that you can do after oh my any God. Open. So that can super crazy. beautiful looking kick. <laughs> oh no, it's it dodge, it after whatever you like. So that's super cool there as well. You get a lot of those mix-ups, all that stuff is really built in. Yeah, switch in music. Uh, but then you're gonna look at me, you're gonna say, eh, you know what? This is just like a you know two-hit chain hero. Yeah, yeah. J J JC, yeah. when I look at this, I just see a two-hit chain hero. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> that's that's, that's kind of weird, right? A little bit. So no. what she can do is that after every single attack in her recovery, similar to what we have with some other heroes, you can do a recovery cancel. Ooh, okay. It's not a regular dodge cancel, right? What? It's a flip that she does. But <laughs> oh you can my see right now, gosh. and what's cool is that I'm doing it like just pressing dodge, right? Mm -hmm. But you can also do it sideways. Oh. <laughs> you can do it front as well. Oh no. Right? So <laughs> this that's exactly what I saw oh, when GC's oh. like, oh, <laughs> yeah. let's have let's have movement. And that's because the first yeah, yeah. the first time we did those those transitions, I was really cool to do. We did the back first, what? and it looked amazing. And we were like, I think I think at that time we did, we like, oh, we should do it like on different side because that when we do play session yeah. and we play and we're like, oh, I wish I can do it on the side as well. So. So we, we start allowing it to do it, and the but the backflip was sli sliding. So we went back to mocap. Yep. I'm mm. like, DC, stop hiding stuff. Like, <laughs> and it, but it looks so cool, and it's so fun to do it as well. Like when you do it, it's just that's so funny. Satisfying. Yeah, it's super satisfying. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And so out of this backflip, you can't get hit. Yeah. Here you have a knee here, like a little oh bash my that goes goodness. pretty quick, goes pretty far. Uh, works really, really well. You can also do it off of a side one if you want. You can do it off of a front one. You can do it at any point you want here. Um, so that's super interesting as well. Uh, what's cool with this is that you know, really using a lot of stuff in like target swapping, mm -hmm. deciding what di what direction so you're going to you go in when you flip and you do things, uh, really, really helps her move around the battlefield. I assume you can. That, that works really, really well. The next thing I want to really highlight is uh, after any single one of her bashes, so if they are like kick or knee based bashes so after this one or after this one you get uh, a guaranteed light yeah or a guaranteed heavy finisher that keeps the properties that we have when you're doing them normally right oh my so if i go it might sound a bit weird to go like this and go oh this is unblockable mm. uh but still it works really really well and it can it works here as well right i can do the top i can go this one that displaces again. Um, and whenever it's off of shield-based bashes, it's the same logic here, right? Okay. And what's really interesting here is, I don't know if, if you've noticed, and Vanessa can talk about mm -hmm. this, right? When I'm doing your heavy finishers normally, they look like this. 
If I do them after kick, they look completely different, even though they have the same properties. And if I do them after a bash, they also look different. Yes. Right? So you want to walk us through this? Yeah, because we designed them to, to be like you have your shield more in, in your presence as well, like when we design. And we That's wanted to so have like cool. variety of animation in uh, just to like let you, like guide you through the mm -hmm. chain that you want to do. So, and, and for, for this character specifically, like the shield, yes, she has a shield. She's not the first one to have a shield, but technically the shield is a weapon. In, yeah. For, in, like in, in how it's made, it's, it's, it, Use as a weapon, so that's why when you bash and uh, maybe do something else with it, but no. the, <laughs> the 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 shell is really like a part, like uh, really part of the the. And I like the design, like the nook, like yeah, the, the, the little, little hook, oh, yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. And, and we like, use it in the stance as well, like right. We, yeah, we, if you switch from that side to the other side, there yeah. you see that kind of pu she pushes the mace out. Yeah, as soon as we saw it in the the, the design, as, at first we're like, oh my god, we can use that and. The guard break That's and like cool. all yeah, the, those kind of moves and I'm uses. So it was, we evolve like the whole team evolve and adapt. It was it was really fun to do. Yeah, because there, there's even something about that in the guard break itself too. Mm -hmm. right? Yeah, when you guard yeah, break, yeah. she kind of yeah she kind of punches yeah. with yeah. the shield. I, I a, love that animation. It's a late yeah. your face to uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> damage. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. It's like it she gets it right in the hook. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, it looks cool. super super cool. Nice. Um, she also has a. Regular, pretty fast zone attack from neutral. Uh, that also counts as an opener. So you can afterwards, you can flip afterwards if you want. Yeah. Uh, she has a running attack. Oh. Ah. Again, counts as an opener. So kind of everything kind of counts as an opener. So that works really, really well, mm -hmm. and that's cool. I think like even her, like the way she runs, she looks super interesting here. Like I really like. She's the fast. Way that, that works. Yeah. And then there's another little trick. Uh, that I'm gonna show people. Right? There's oh. more. Oh. You know, like uh, I was talking about relentless reach. Right, like right? I'm so far away, right? You're super far. <laughs> you can't, you I can't, can't get. Right, like I'm gonna you try to like me. hit you with a light I'm or safe whatever. Over here. Here. I'm safe. But wait, if I try to do that neutral bash, yeah. this is what happens. Oh yeah, he Whoa. runs towards your opponent and then hits them with your shield. Right. Somebody, you uh, so that. this is super cool. That's what we mean Close by relentless gap. reach. That she mm. can really run towards her opponent. Uh, even while you're running, you can move around a little bit. So if the, if your opponents are on a corner, you can kind of like curve around the corner. Have that good stuff going. Uh, it's you so can, fun to pull out this. Oh yeah, it's super cool. You can faint that run okay, at yeah, any yeah. point during the That's run, awesome. so you can get the bait or something. Crazy if you want. Uh -huh. um, you can also cancel it with a flip, so you can go like this, whoop, or go a little bit further out. Yeah, there we go. You cancel with a flip. I can cancel it with like a side flip if I want to. I can do like whatever I'd like here. Uh, so. It's interesting to go to That's really have like that sort of control geez. here, mm -hmm. and Talk really about unique running hero. My and what I want to do when I, what's going to happen. And we wanted to give her options when she's running, so that if there's opponents nearby, I try to hit you out of it. You can anticipate it, do a flip, try to avoid them, yeah. faint, block, do whatever you'd like. That works super, super well. It's, Talk it's about very, very cool. Up. And I think oh run, my gosh, like we, I cannot it, it kinda, It's a bit similar to like, you know, we have a Rochi that runs like this a little bit, but it's it looks so different, mm -hmm. and the outcome is really strong. Yeah, because she's yeah. looking at you, and she has her shield like, in front, because she's still like, she's tactical. Like, it's, it's part of her yeah. character. So she's yeah. like, she knows where she's going, and like, yeah. don't let her reach you, because... It's yeah. just, it's a doom train mm -hmm. coming yeah. her way right there, <laughs> so yeah. Uh, she also has uh, superior block dodges, so you can see the shield flashing here. Oh. On top, and then uh, you're gonna do me a sure. top attack. I will do that. Right, do it again. Yeah, yeah. Well, ah. And so when you hit guard break, uh, when you successfully block with this, you get a shield bash. Mm, she bonked okay. me again. <laughs> so many bonks. That leads ah. to those heavy finishers that are faster yeah. as well. It comes from a shield, so you get the shield variant of those attacks exactly, as well. Yeah. Nice. So we really want to have like that a lot of cohesion there, and have that aspect really, really like shine through, and have this. So that's really, really cool. Uh, wow. You want to show a couple of emotes, maybe? Uh, I mean, sure, if we want to do a little, uh, nice. little handstand there. That's I want to see what feet she has. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad I got this this character. I'm very excited. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it looks really amazing. She's styling. Just styling. She's, She's showing off her skill, right? Yeah. I, now, now, Vanessa, from from an animation standpoint, at mocap, like, did did you actually, you had the mocap actor yeah, you did that. Stands. I mean, we, we might have cheated a little bit and hold him in place, to be honest. <laughs> but <Yeah>. I mean, <laughs> you know, we do what we can. But but with with her, I mean, she's flipping a lot. So the like, the guys has to like to do flipping for like eight hours stuff. Yeah, at some point. It's pretty. Uh, it's pretty tiring just to look at them. So I don't even like imagine like just doing them. You know. So. <laughs> Seems exhausting. <laughs> oh. Yeah, we have a little flip.